Hi friends, today I will see how to amend any purchase order. Okay, for this, first I have to check my purchase order ME23N. Okay, uh, use the transaction code ME23N. Getting uh, this is my purchase order for the amounting 2,98,685 rupees, and this is in the release state. And now I have to reduce this amount. Uh, I just want to reduce this amount to 1,40,527 rupees. Getting my points? So for this, the transaction code is uh, ZMMP underscore INI underscore amend. The transaction code is ZMMP underscore transaction. Okay. Uh, you have to choose the document category uh, that in my case, this is the purchase order and uh, uh, 4200. Uh, nine double six five double three getting you just click on execute you have no authorization to release this is the error message in my company but the w uh, the this purchase order is uh, has been now amended it's come in my inbox okay okay it's come in my inbox okay and uh, now you just check this through me23n okay see before it was in the release state now it's in unreleased state getting my points so i'm just using the transaction code me22n to change the purchase order to change the purchase order i am using the transaction code me22n okay I am going in the detail. I am going in the detail. This is the service. I am just going to change the amount of the service. Okay. 2,98,685. But approved amount, was, approved amount is 1,40,527.88. Getting 1,40,527.88 rupees. Okay now the tax is tax is mc that is no credit nine percent sgst and nine percent cgst and percent nine uh, this is nine percent sgst nine percent cgst okay no credit now uh, you have to just save this purchase order then automatically amount will be changed I'm just version status is not completed okay so go in the header field go in the header field click on the version go in the header field click on the version and now save it once you just click on this save button then your then your purchase order is likely to be changed ME23N through ME23N you can just check that this purchase order is now changes to new value getting my points this purchase order is now changes to new value getting my points okay well like 40,527.88 rupees getting my points now I'm trying now I'm trying to now I am trying to release this purchase order. Okay. Now I am trying to release this purchase order because it's now in our uh, inbox. Getting. Uh, the competent authority for the release of this purchase order is 9830643 and 9830643. Uh, Kindly, please approve the the PO with respect to civil maintenance work. Civil subdivision Ambala. Okay. Now I am going to initiate this purchase order.
okay for the approval getting my points i'm just going to initiate this purchase order for this approval okay now i'm just using the competent authority purchase order competent authority okay 9830 getting come into inbox this is the process of the approval of the purchase order document through inbox getting my points and go in the inbox click on this final release okay now this po has been released getting my points now this po has been released check the purchase order in me 23n check this document in me 23n go in the release strategy now this release check on the print preview One four zero five two seven point eight eight one two six four seven point. Okay. This is the purchase order. Now you have to take the printout of this purchase order. Me nine F is a T code. Me nine F is a T code. click on the output message so through this t code you have to execute this and check for the print out i mean 9f again need not to worry for that the purchase order has been created now okay so this is all about the Uh, purchase order amendment and change the value and then save and then release from the competent authority thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day